things out. Hey, Camby. The energy out here at the finish line is crazy. They are finishing the kayaking. You can see them pulling in right through here after running and biking. They also have the opportunity to do stand up paddle boarding. That's a first this year. We've already had a lot of the first place people coming through. And the people that you want to look for are the ones with the wreaths, like Robin is wearing here. This is their team. Let me introduce you Sarah, Robin, and Karen. You guys are in the 50 plus right now. Which one of you ran? I ran. You ran, and how long was that? 40 um, minutes and 17 seconds. Okay, but is it, it's three miles. How many miles? Five it's uh, 5.82. 5.82 miles and then you did the biking did right the there. Biking. how long was that that was 12 and a half miles 12 and a half miles biking and then you did the kayaking you brought it home <laughs> and how long was that about six miles goodness gracious now you guys have been doing this 12 years how did you guys form a team well she's new to the team this year okay but gosh we've been robin together always a leader. <laughs> yeah robin has always had a team but she you know kind of picked up people in the, um off and on and i have stuck with her <laughs> Why, why, yeah, why do you guys like doing this? Why do Epi's Great Race? I do it for Robin because she's our dreamer. She's our inspired, you know, she inspires us and, you know, she always gives the goal for us. And I can feel the endorphins coming up, you guys. You're in such good moods after all this Contact workout. Runner's okay, high. let me really put the icing on the cake here, okay? Both of these ladies had twins. Wow. They're 50 plus. Her abs, I, I, you're the first person I saw when I got here. I'm trying to plan when I'm going to eat Mexican food, and this girl has abs. I'm jealous of these. I mean, this is insane. The, the craziness and the excitement, does that really get you through when, as you're finishing your kayak and you see all these people? What's that like? It's the best race you can do. I'm telling you, it is the race. And then you get so done fun. You get done biking. We saw the point where you guys cross over. You're tagging her in so she can do the kayaking. What's that like to see your teammates? there at the end of all those miles. It is just so exciting, you know, and, and coming down the, the bike trail was just amazing with all the, the drafting and pulling people and and I uh, came running across and I'm like, Robin! <laughs> people are watching, it's in its 43rd year, but maybe people want next year to be their first year doing this. What should they know going into this about training for this? Well, they should run a lot, bike a lot, and kayak a lot. <laughs> there you go. That's a perfect advice. Perfect advice. A great way uh, to honor Epi, his uh, son George, out here this morning uh, as we're getting to see some of these people run through. Some of them, my grandparents' age, beating kids that are like 15, 16 years old. It's, it's very inspiring. Oh, yeah. She had me beat. I was the great runner, part of the great team last year, 53 minutes for that 5.82 miles, and I was booking it, man. I was, I'm normally slow. You know, I'm more the, mm -hmm. the long distance runner, not yeah. so much the short distance. The short? She killed I'm it. I'm really good at like eight feet. <laughs> and then after that, it's over. Guitar students are taking over.